Using a finger to help a bar can even cause problems when the bar is less than a full bar. In Carcassi's study number three, part two, we have this passage. Where we're barring four strings, and if we allow that second finger to help the bar, little finger can fall dangerously low in the fourth fret and end up buzzing the G sharp. Plus, going on, if this finger is helping the bar, he's needed for that A sharp. And just as you just saw, he could, you know, messes up his placement, ends up low in the fret or not enough power on the finger and ends up buzzing. Instead, keep that second finger independent of the first finger. Don't allow it to help the bar.